A much needed medication is in short supply just as demand for it is high. The drug is albuterol. It's used to treat patients with asthma and other breathing disorders. WGNO's LBJ is following the story. LB. Yes, yeah, Susie and Kurt, the most critical albuterol shortage is the variety used in hospitals, mostly treating children. And there's word, no word, on when the shortage will end. The issue really is that we have only a limited number of suppliers here in the United States. One of the main factories producing albuterol in the Chicago area closed down. And so um, the production is just not very diversified. All of our eggs are in one basket. Children's Hospital Chief Dr. Mark Klein speaking to what has been one major factor in creating the shortage of the drug albuterol. Klein says not all forms of the drug are in short supply. The issue really is around the liquid albuterol, the, the stuff that's put into the machines to aerosolize the medicine for children who are here in the hospital, for a few young children at home too. At Chateau Drugs in Metairie, pharmacist Carrie Milano says the shortage of the drug often means okay. patients pay more for the medication. Absolutely. The insurance has a set fee. They go by the price that when the thing was available, they're charging you, they're paying you that price. They're not going to pay the new price, you know. So either you eat it or the customer gets it, you know. Back at Children's, Klein also attributes COVID and RSV as contributing factors to the shortage. The demand has been uh, extraordinary. We've had so many children admitted to this hospital and many other hospitals with respiratory virus illness, and many of them do require albuterol for treatment. In turn, their physicians have had to be creative in treating patients. We've managed to find supplies in most cases. We use alternative medications when we have to. Um, and in some cases, we've gone to the metered dose inhaler rather than to the nebulizer machine. So the company at the heart of this is Acorn uh, Pharmaceuticals. They shut down all three of its U.S. plants, submit a second bankruptcy in three years. Both Klein and Milano says uh, uh, no end in sight for the shortage. Susie, Kurt? Uh, big worry for a lot yeah. of parents for yes. sure. Mm -hmm. Thank you, OBJ.